The Nebraska National Guard has been preparing for a different kind of disaster this weekend. Channel 8's Joe Harris is here to show us how. Joe. Nicole, the National Guard has been training for how to respond to a chemical explosion. The Guard has been preparing their troops for what to do in case it ever happens. Nebraska has never had to respond to a chemical explosion, but this is how they prepare, just in case. 600 soldiers from Nebraska and Missouri have been taking part in exercises in search and rescue, decontamination, and medical triage. It's part of regular training to give chemical explosion response teams the closest to real life experience. It is absolutely important to practice this. So we, this is our first real major event in about a year. Uh, and so we're, we're knocking the rust off out here and it, it never goes as well the first time. So you gotta practice and you gotta just get repetition. Lieutenant Governor Mike Foley was at Saturday's training. Foley says one of his roles as Lieutenant Governor is Director of Homeland Security, reporting to the governor about disaster preparedness and response. He says it's good seeing all the action firsthand. It's uh, sobering but also comforting to know that people are, uh, have great expertise, they're planning, they're, they're training, they're experiencing the reality of what could happen, uh, so they're prepared for all kinds of weather circumstances and every possible type of uh, emergency, from extracting bodies from a, from a cave-in or dealing with hazardous chemicals or some kind of a power plant explosion. The National Guard will continue this training on Monday. Now, we also spoke to a soldier about this training. He said it's important to prepare for these types of events so they're ready when disaster strikes. Absolutely good to see that they are prepared. Thank you, Joe.